Papers, Everyday Paper back again with guess what? Yes, another juice review, and this time we have one from Button Junkie. This is Vulture Punch, very kindly sent to me by the guys at vapeclub.co.uk. They have got a great range of liquids on their website, well worth checking out, and they've also got a good range of hardware too. Now, Button Junkie, UK company, um, I don't think they've been around that long, I think it's quite a new company, 2015. Not a lot of information on them. Um, apart from they do create uh, some good liquids. I don't know if they've been tested for any hidden nasties. And it doesn't say anywhere whether the ingredients are USP grade, although I would presume they would be. In this day and age, for a large company not to use USP grade would be, you know, bad form really. Okay, so let's have a quick look at the, the bottle itself then. I'm just going to focus it in for you. There we go. So we've got a vulture mixing up some punch. It comes in this lovely square glass bottle. Um, it's very thick glass as well. It comes with the childproof cap and also it comes with the uh, glass dropper in there. So you've got all the relevant details on there. You've got the caution, you've got the ingredients. You've also got um, the traceability as well, a batch number and a best before end date, which makes it fully CLP compliant, which is great stuff um, you know, to see for big companies making it CLP compliant top notch. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to try it out in a cave bun uh, to begin with. Now, I know that um, this one is a 70-30 blend, so 70 VG, 30 PG. There's no option to change that VG-PG ratio. It does come in some good uh, nicotine strength, though. The one I've got here is 3 milligrams, but it does come in 0, 1.5 milligrams, 3 and 6 milligrams. So it's pretty much aimed at your drippers or your sub ohm tanks rather than your um, k and things like that. But we're going to give it a go. Here we go. 1.5 ohms, 12 and a half watts, as always to begin with. So the flavour profile of this one is strawberries and cream. But I don't think it is strawberries and cream. It's got a kind of custody taste to it. There's a definite custody in there. There's also sweetness, like um, a sugary taste. Let me just dig out the flavor profile. Yeah, custard, and also it's got caramel, there's brown sugar in it, and it's also got Madagascan vanilla bean. giving it a really rich taste to it. Yeah, that brown sugar is giving it a good sweetness and it, it does taste like brown sugar. And then you've got that. Strawberries are quite subtle. The Madagascan vanilla bean, the vanilla you can taste coming through and there's their elements of custard. Let's try it in a dripper, 21.5 watts, 0.6 ohms, as always to begin. So low watts you're getting a bit more of that strawberry flavour taste. Not so much of the brown sugar. And then there's the elements of the custard there. Let's try it at 40 then. Yeah, nice vanilla. That vanilla is very, very good kind of creaminess of the custard underneath, not massively, it's like brown sugar, the big elements at this stage is brown sugar, that vanilla and then the strawberries, but the strawberries at this one are getting pushed back a bit. So let's pop it up to 60. Yeah, very sweet from that sugar. Real sugary taste coming through. Nice vanilla flavour. Strawberries in the background and a bit of that custard coming through. So it's a, a sweet vape, that's for sure. With that brown sugar. Um, and the, the, that Madagascar vanilla gives a real richness to the taste. That's a nice liquid. So Vulture Punch from 
button junkie you can get that from get vape uh, for the 30 mil bottle i think it's 30 mils is no 50 mil is eight pound 49 if you wanted a 30 mil let me just check the prices for 30 mil 30 mil is going to cost you 15 uh, 15 pounds 49 pence so pretty good value as well so button junkie uh, vulture punch from vape club check it out